Welcome to Year 6's virtual tour. Over the next few minutes we hope to show you um, some examples of some of the fantastic work that's been going on across the year group um, during the past few weeks. Welcome to ACER class and we're going to show you some of the work we've been busy doing this term. We've really enjoyed our artwork this term. We focused on the art of Lisa Condon, who um, does a lot of work online and on social media. And we started with a collage and we based it on the style, sort of graphic style of flowers that she draws. After researching her, we did lots of work in our sketchbooks. And I had a go at trying to draw flowers in the same style. Finally, we created some printing pieces of work um, using craft foam to create printing templates. In science, we have been working on electricity and we focused on the dangers of electricity and how to stay safe, both in the home and outside the home. And more recently, we've been looking at animals, including humans, and particularly fo focusing on the heart. Uh, so we've learned about the different parts of the heart. We've done some experiments uh, talking about how nutrients and water are passed around the body through the blood using osmosis and diffusion. In history, we've been learning about the Maya. So we made a timeline we found out about Maya numbers, the Maya number system. We researched Maya buildings, Maya cities, and looked at Maya beliefs and gods. We also learned about food and designed some really delicious menus. In maths we've been doing some work on data and statistics and have been finding out how to create a pie chart, how to work out the size of each angle. We've also done some work on conversion graphs and line graphs and have learnt to use compasses to draw circles. We also enjoyed doing some weaving to create some Maya plates. In English, we created non-chronological reports about different creatures. Um, based on Arthur Spiderwick's field guide. In preparation of our transition to uh, Year 7, um, we have been completing uh, the booklets which have been provided by um, Watford Trust all about positive minds and how our children can cope um, and be equipped with the right skills to start Year 7. And in PSHE we've been focusing on relationships and really been thinking about our feelings, um, how we can be good friends, 
how we can include other people and make sure nobody's feeling left out and been looking at different scenarios uh, to help us cope with those, um, those situations. Welcome to Redford class. And based on the book, The Arthur Spiderwick Chronicles, of the fantastical world around us, after those river troll poems, we created some of our own creatures. We wrote a brilliant report. Also in English, we started our term with Herman, the mouse detective. We wrote some fabulous letters. In art, we looked at the work of the graphic artist Lisa Condon. Here are our sketchbooks on our way to our final pieces. That magnificent flower. And here are our final pieces, our ink print flowers in vases and these vases are created by hand just using black felt tip pen and they're amazing in science humans and health we've been looking at osmosis most recently after our study of the heart in the circulatory system and prior we looked at electricity and the dangers of electricity and we created some danger posters which are fabulous in our re in year six um, we study Buddhism and Christianity, but we also look at the world views of different people. And we recently created Lessons for Living based on the world views of those that we've been comparing and studying. In maths, the children want to show off their scaling and some calculations and their line graphs and pie charts and how they were interpreting some very complicated data, which I did very well, leading to our pie charts, constructing pie charts, which we did and had great fun doing. And obviously we've been studying the Maya. And here's a sample of all of our work, plus our weaving, where we created masks. And obviously we've been studying the Maya. And here's a sample of all of our work, plus our weaving, where we created masks. Our Maya work, our report writing, timelines, gods and menus, That's some more of our Maya work. And finally, the children want to show off their whole class reading, which was The Beetle Boy, 
and then we looked at non-fiction text of Beatles and poetry. I hope you enjoyed the tour and look forward to the next one. You may recognise some of the work on this board. It's some of the work the children created during lockdown and we have called it our wall of wonder to reflect some of the fantastic and wonderful work that went on during their time at home. In art, the children enjoyed researching and finding out all about the graphic artist Lisa Congdon, um, experimenting with her style, looking at her techniques and how she laid out her different different aspects of her prints. In computing this term, we are creating our own text adventure games where the player gets to decide what happens next. The children have been planning their adventures in Purple Mash using 2Connect, mapping each page and linking them on 2Create. The next task will be coding the adventures. In science, in our electricity work, we had great fun investigating circuits and changing the variables to increase the brightness of the bulb, then designed an effective circuit for a dog doorbell. We discussed potential dangers of electricity and made posters and leaflets to illustrate the safety rules. We're now investigating the human circulatory system, exploring the human heart and conducting an investigation to identify the impact of exercise on our heart rate. We also had great fun with skittles and jelly worms to help us to understand how our bodies absorb nutrients in water. And here are just a few photographs of the children during science lessons. Some of the topics we've covered in maths has included work on scaling, calcul calculating volume, interpreting data and representing data in pie charts and conversion graphs. On to English and the children enjoyed using the book Hermelin the Detective Mouse with its stunning illustrations to write a diary entry. Using the book Arthur Spiderwick's Field Guide, uh, the children designed their own fantastical creatures before writing a report in the style of the author. We've just started our next unit of work using Michael Morpurgo's The Giant's Necklace as our key text. Starting off by researching Cornwall, the book's setting, the children will be going on to do some narrative writing using a range of skills and figurative language. The class have worked really hard on the, our history topic, the Maya, and here you can see some of the work they produced collaboratively using the Chromebooks. Here in their books you can see the timeline that they produced and some work here on some of the um, aspects of the civilization that they looked at in more detail, such as religion, architecture. And here's some work looking at Maya food. 
and some wonderful drawings of Chichen Itza. And finally here are some of the plates that the children made by first of all colouring in the centre and choosing carefully the colours before matching with some of the wool and thank you very much for, to those of you who kindly donated some and you can see that they work so carefully focusing well and showing their motor skills well that's all for now um, we've got a very busy few weeks ahead of us but we look forward to sharing some more work with you later on in the term <laughs>